Hey, it's been a long time since I made a Porsche video, but here's a fun one that I'm working on right now. Um, right now, um, my window does not drop when I open the door, and so you have to manually put the window down before you open the passenger door and put it back up, you know, after the, the door is shut. Uh, kind of annoying, uh, very big risk for a for a person to, a guest to close the door and shatter the glass. You know, there's a risk there. So what I bought is this thing off Suncoast. It's a new micro switch, hoping that fixes it. It just, yeah, do it right here, come on, yeah. So it attaches to the door handle. And uh, I haven't seen that many videos on this. I really, there's nothing. So. I got the door skin off over there, and then I've unbolted all the 30 Torx. There's, I don't know, about 10 of them. And now, I want to show you what we're actually looking at. Um, because now I got to get to the door handle. I don't think I have to take the door handle out, but I definitely need to um, unbolt it. So. Got the flashlight in here, so it's loose. It's not unattached because you know there's wires and whatnot. I got the Torx. It's still loose. It's loose-ish. It's not coming out, but you have access from down here. And if I can position this. So if you lay on the ground and then shine a light up in there and what we're actually looking for is two 10 millimeter bolts. So see those, see those bolts right there on the right next to my flashlight? There's what we need to remove and you can see the harness that we need to replace. Uh, it goes through the skin, so we have to get get to it from the other side. But I'm gonna use a ratcheting uh, wrench to get those out, because all I can do is get my hand in there. And we'll get to the other side. All right, after much struggling, I got the two 10 millimeter nuts off. Uh, my hand, is just a little gashed, but not so bad. Not not bleeding yet. So what we're looking for is underneath this plate, you can see the sensor right there. So we gotta get this little cladding piece off and see if we can get this to come out just a little bit and we can un undo that mount and then unplug it from the other side and uh, hopefully we don't have to completely remove this door handle. Okay so there's no point in trying to film from inside that door panel it's just not gonna work but what it looks like is that I can unlock the little tabs um, that attach to the little the nubs here um, there's a plastic piece that pries away. I can do that from the inside. Uh, and then this thing is just orientated. So if it's like this, let me zoom out. So if it, it's kind of like this. So the plug is straight down. You pull this away and it's then underneath, like here, but it's it's sticking. The mount is like this, so there's a clip right here. Um, you got to use a little screwdriver. Unattach that. It looks like this thing's one clip here and one clip here, but it doesn't even look like it is, at least inside my door. And then I think I can just feed this thing up reattach it and then 
button the whole thing back together and everything should work. That's, that's the plan. Because I really don't want to pull the door handle off if I don't have to. And, of course, today is a heat advisory. It's going to be a real feel of 108 today. So, I am trying to get this done as quickly as I can before I die. Alright, another quick note is that I just pulled on the harness to get some more room so I could unplug it. And this piece stayed in. So this just slides out. So I'm going to slide the new harness into the Christmas tree that's already there. Might make it easier. But that's what I'm doing. Alright, so there's the nubs from, I'm sitting underneath the door, laying on the ground, but that's the new, new wire. This harness just needs to connect in, and we're pretty much done. We just got to put everything back. Alright, I probably should show the door actually working, so, oops, unlock, goes down, see it's below the lip. Back up. And we're up and running again. So, hope uh, hope this helps and hope it solves some of your guys' issues that like what I had. It's a couple hours of work and hopefully you have a garage that makes it a, a little bit more comfortable. Thanks for watching.